Taita Taveta County Assembly have voted unanimously to send their governor, Granton Samboja, home over allegations of gross misconduct. The vote followed weeks of a standoff pitting the MCAs against the executive. All the 30 MCAs present voted in favor of the impeachment motion. Ken Mijungu reports that it will now be up to the Senate to either uphold his, this decision or reinstate the first-time governor. After weeks of plotting against Governor Granton Samboja, the members of the county assembly made good their threat and convened with one agenda in mind. All the 30 present in this special sitting voted in favor of the motion, tabled by one Harris Keke and seconded by Godwin Kilele. public eye, kwamba what we have been, uh, you know, yearning for is uh, the end of this stalemate, which of course uh, it may cost to Ataita Taveta uh, mambo mengi. The MCAs accused the governor of irresponsibility, abuse of office, misappropriation of funds, failure to submit to the county assembly an annual report on implementation status of the county policies and plans, failure to remit statutory deductions to the relevant authorities such as the Kenya Revenue Authority and the National Hospital Insurance Fund, and failure to adhere to county assembly resolution on the reinstatement of David Mwangoma as the acting county executive committee member for finance and economic planning. But kitu ambacho tuliona kwamba wenda governor bado hako tayari kwa mazungumzo. Tangu mazungumzo hayo yaanze governor hakuwai kutokea. Sababu yeye ndio ilikuwa musika wa kwanza. In August, the ward representatives threatened to impeach Governor Samboja for ignoring their effort to reconcile with him after disagreeing over the budget. Samboja declined to approve the budget after the MCS slashed the executive's allocation and instead directed the money to the ward development fund. Samboja will then say his administration will seek the dissolution of the assembly and by the end of August, the governor said he had collected 52,100 signatures with the intention of petitioning President Kenyatta to dissolve the county assembly. Efforts by the national government to have the governor reconcile with his MCAs were futile as he rejected every council. Samboja will be given an opportunity to defend himself before the Senate and depending on the outcome, he will leave office or retain his seat. Samboja may in the interim go to court to suspend his removal. He becomes the second governor to be impeached by the county assembly after Embus Martin Wambora. Ken Mijungu, NTV.